numbers for y'all's position there. <laughs> Well, you, you had quarterback separation until. Uh, you know, it's just, again, it goes back to, you know, I, I had, we had two days that uh, felt really good about them, and then, you know, they didn't feel really good about either one of them. Uh, you know, they just started off bad, and then it took them a while to get, to, to get their composure. They did have some drops, you know, that, uh, that hurt them, but, uh, again, we we're a long way from where we need to be at that position. Run game had spurts today. Yeah, you know, I think we can do some things run game. We, we kind of save some of the guys that run too much. You know, Maggie and of course Jeff's field and not one more day. I think he'll be back Monday and, and ready to go. But, um, you know, I think we have some quarterback runs that look like good, but we're going to whistle so fast it's really hard to tell what we get on, on those, some of those keepers. But, um, you know, there were some positives, I guess, but uh, you know, I don't know. It felt like it was uh, felt like it was just another practice instead of a scrimmage to me. I don't know if it had. I wish we could have gone in the stadium, but uh, you know, we got to learn to play in whatever circumstances we're in. I thought the defense had good energy. They got turnovers, which is good for that side, not too good for our side. But, uh, I mean, there were some positives. It's never as bad as it seems when you watch the film. It's never as good as it seems. So uh, we'll go in. And, Back after a minute. I know you don't. Did you body that they weren't more jacked up for screaming? A little bit. Sure did. A little bit. And, uh, our coaches will take that personally. And see if we can't uh, correct that next side. I know you haven't had the benefit of the film yet, obviously, but was there anything on any of those interceptions that you saw? Was it was it read bad reads or bad decisions? No, I know the last one. You know, I was standing behind them after a while. Uh, the last one that both threw was exactly the right read, and he just threw an awful ball, ten yards off line. Uh, Barry the same way when he threw in the red zone down here. You know, I like the, the, the decision to go to the one-on-one -on -one matchup there, but he threw it way inside. You know, and you just, it's a bad spot. It's got to be out where we get it or nobody gets it. And uh, I can't remember the others. Uh, those are the two that stand out in my mind right now. Hey, how much your pressure for this? Yeah, I'm excited about them. I thought Jalen and I tell you this looked, uh, looked good, particularly on the tired legs, day age. You know, everybody's a little fatigued. I'm sure that had some things to do with some of it, but uh, I thought Jalen and Octavius had spurts that they looked really good. They're still swimming and making mistakes, but you know, we did think that they, they showed that your quality backs. How was Aaron Morris? Uh, Aaron, we expect to, to start moving around tomorrow. So whether or not he can go full speed on Monday, I'm not sure, but he's getting close. He's out of the boot, but he's getting close. Talk about the development of your offensive line to this point from day one. Well, I think Matt's doing a fine job with them. I think uh, they're starting to, to understand things a little more. Uh, we're still uh, not deep enough there, but it shows. But uh, we're definitely better than they were uh, day one when we started, and that's all we can ask is that uh, the guys coaching those positions and the guys giving the effort there to, to get better or bring it every day to improve, and they have improved without question.